Hi guys and welcome back to Dawn of Man, I'm Risen32, so you have joined us, we have just been raided as soon as I've loaded the game up, we get the time going here, we'll see what's going to happen, I, don't, I hear the raiders, they are coming from the so called north, shall we say, are you a raider? You're not a raider, no, where are the raiders? Oh okay, we've got five of them, oh this will be a test to see how we do with this, um, we're going to need some fighters over there, so we, let's just pause it, and take these guys and then we'll have them selected hopefully they aren't they have damaged our our towers down okay cool so how are they doing with the walls we need to send some people over here let's get them out no let's bring you this way attack this person here let's get stuck into him we can't got to deal with this as quick as we can they're in no rush to get here though so we're gonna have to repair these walls it's going to be a shame. Maybe we need another watchtower over here. Possibly. As everyone comes running in now. Okay, we dealt with him. And this chap. Don't just go home, guys. We're just getting started. Okay, is that everyone? Can't see. Yeah, that's everyone. Okay, right. So let's turn that off. And we're also in a food shortage. <laughs> Which we don't really need. So we need to get these walls repaired straight away. So let's get this just set up here. Get you in there. We'll get another wall in here. That's not a wall, is it? That's the wall there. There we go. So we'll get another wall built here. Can we... Oh, no, we can't. Can... Oh, we can do that. Okay, awesome. Cool. So, and we're just going to put these at a priority to get our defences up again. We're going to want some watchtowers. But I'm not sure we're going to be able to afford these. Or we're going to be in a position to put these in for a little while. I'm going to put three in here now. After that. And we'll put another one back here. And hopefully we should see that. Just increase our defences. That's, that's what I'm hoping with that. So we can go back up to time speed 8. Now, as I was saying before we got attacked. Is we are in having a bit of a food shortage. We've got a load of carts being built. Which are prioritised. You can see here, we're going to get a few food warnings. We have got a harvest going, so this is this is all going to hopefully tie in. Our workload is high on everyone. So hopefully we can get majority of these fields done before autumn comes. Well, we're in fall before winter comes, otherwise we're going to lose some of the crops. I su suspect that's not going to happen, which is why we're in a food shortage. So what's our population? 65, we've got room for 11 more people. Probably don't need them. So if we just keep pushing forward. Also, I th what have we got on the jobs wise? We've got someone bringing in a megalith at the moment. People repairing, that's good to see. Get our walls repaired. And then we kind of need everybody on food. We're getting a bit of grain in. We've got five grains sat inside. So we just need... Are we low on sickles? No, we've got 17 sickles. That shouldn't be a problem. We've got a lot of repairs that need doing as well. So people are definitely overloaded. We have no food now. This is an issue. Have we, have we got hunters out. We didn't. Okay, you guys, let's hunt this pig here. You're not mine, are you? No, you are mine. Okay, good. And you're also mine as well. Okay, so we've got some animals. So, okay, another knowledge point. We're up to 22. What do we need to go through? So we need 20. Okay, so we can unlock copper. There we go. Let's get the copper unlocked. Let's pause it and have a little look here and see what we can get built. So, what has this unlocked? So it's opened metallurgy and given us access to a copper mine. So pit furnace, metalsmith, charcoal pit. Okay, interesting. Anything with the storage? No, we haven't got a warehouse yet. Um, defense, I don't need to know about defense. Houses are the same. So we, we've only we've just unlocked a new technology here and a workshop. Okay, that's going to be handy. So we're going to need to get these built, but I don't want to rush ahead and build these at the moment. Can we make... Oh, we could replace one of our crafters with a workshop, actually. That's a good idea. So we need to make charcoal. We've just got four, no four new people join us. That may help with the food. We can see the food going up. It is going up, which is good. Okay. All our houses need repairs. What do you need to repair you? Are you repaired? Are you going to tell me what you need? No, it's not going to tell me. No. Okay, so we're getting a few deaths now. 
and we're low on food but we have got hunters out there hunting we've got harvest coming in we've got quite a lot of grain now so that is good so hopefully we should see i'm hoping this is going to enable us to survive the winter right so how are we doing over here so we've got our walls back up some of our people don't have clothing that is not 55 yeah so our, i need a work shop but i think before we get in the workshop we need to make Pitfoot melts copper and tin ores into copper and bronze. Yep. Place to make charcoal from wood. So we're going to need a charcoal pit. And we're going to have to start moving over into the newer area of our settlement. Where do we want to make charcoal? So I think we may do it in this rear corner over here. We're going to have a bit of a production area. So we just want the one for the moment. Oh, so we've got... So we've got animal breeding going on now, which is good. That's going to help us too. That's what I've been trying to get going for a little while now. Um, a metalsmith, a place to make copper and bronze tools. So we're going to want you over here. If we rotate you, like so. Yep. Now these are going to be a little while off being built. We can get a furnace here as well. And a copper mine we're going to need. Um, can we see, oh perfect, we've got a nice little copper vein here, anything else? You're not copper, what have we got? another copper vein over there, I'm hoping, this one's really close to us. There we go, that'll be perfect, and anything else close by, we've got another one over here as well, which is handy. So these will all come in helpful, anything near this side? Yeah we do, we've got one up here too, okay awesome. So then we're also going to want to store copper over here. Did we build one of these for copper? I think we did. Your copper. So I'm going to get rid of you because I want to hold the copper over by where we're going to store copper. And we've lost a, a, someone else to starvation. And okay, look, you're getting the smelting pit up straight away. So if we put the copper ore in here, when that's built. Now, where do we just store charcoal? Do we store charcoal in one of these? Yes, we do. Okay. So we don't want the charcoal one over here. I'm going to try and sort of move our production over to the other side of the base now and just get food over here. We're going to have lots of animals. That's my plan. We need more hay. Look at all that hay we're using. Oh, we've got a little bit over here, okay, so that's not too bad. So let's get ourselves another storage. We'll get another rock pile over here. And this is going to be, we can have charcoal, copper. Yep, that's going to work really well. And then we're going to want a workshop over here as well. And we could probably put you something like this. There is going to be a bit of a warp for people getting over here. But it is going to help us in the long run. So we need logs for the charcoal. Okay. So we really need to get these sheep. Okay, so it's all looking good now. I think we may have crossed a little bit of a hurdle here. So we've got lots of goats, sheep, lots of pigs. Old female, young female, young female. Oh, where do they go? Nobody knows. Okay, so we survived the winter. How many knowledge points do we need for the next level? Let's have a little look here. And so it looks like 10 a level. So we can get fruit tree domestication, cattle. I think donkeys is probably going to be the next because then we can get carts. Oh, but we're going to need the wheel. Okay. Sounded like someone just died then. Someone's got a disease and she died of a disease. So we're at 59. So we've had a bit of a drop in population. But hopefully... This sh we should see our food increase as a result. Now, we have got a lot of work going on. Okay, we've got a pig here ready to be slaughtered, which was going to be coming handy. What do we need to build these? We need we need hay. Okay. I wonder if we need an additional hay storage then. I don't think we do. I just think we weren't quick enough harvesting the field to get the resources in. So that's something that we need to focus on too. And I'm kind of hoping that by getting cattle, that it's going to help. I'm just going to speed things up. Sheep's being supported. So we're getting food coming in. Still quite low on food, so we've not got an excess. Um, these aren't full either. No. I think it's kind of a combination of we haven't got enough food or enough people. We do need to get that going. Um, so we people don't have clothing. don't know what I can do about that. You should. We should be making... Have loads of wool. We do. 
No, it's we're starting to head that way. And linen. Are we making linen? They make linen from flax, don't you? So we could probably do a flax field at some stage. Not quite now, though. How are we doing over here? Everything's looking good. We're going to be able to make copper. Yeah, you can make copper and bronze. I'm not going to tell you which one to make. I don't think we're in the bronze age yet. Is that right? So let's have a little look at our knowledge and a little bit more closely now so no bronze is the next stage so maybe making the copper sickle and things that is going to help as well possibly is what i'm thinking with that did we build a metalsmith we did yeah so we're just waiting on so we just need the, the harvest to come in and then we can get those built so let's speed time up and let this happen and then definitely think we're going to push towards getting Donkeys. What do donkeys? That's just carts for moving things around. Horses are better. It's stone carving and netting is in the Bronze Age, which is going to make fishery that little bit better as well. Oh, we can get brew. Awesome. Not under attack, are we? That sounded like we're under attack. And then, what else can we get? So, just looking through here. So we get guard towers in the. The guard towers in there. Reinforced. Oh, we get stone walls and masonry. Okay, awesome. So it looks like we're not going to get anything military orientated in here. But we can definitely speed up things and probably cattle. Maybe we need to go for cattle next. Also, what I want to build is I'm, we're going to have an additional haystack now. Maybe that other one got damaged. Just trying to think where to put this. I might... What was that saying? Some of the people don't like clothing. Okay, it's not the end of the world. I'm going to put one here. Yeah, I'm going to put a second one down as well, just in case. I didn't notice or see if... That must be a trader. How cool is that? What can you sell us? You can sell us some pigs. I don't really need pigs. What we want is food. Take your food and take a load of your flour. Got a little bit of charcoal. Interesting. We'll take it. 22. So we're not really going to need bow axes very much anymore. But let's sell those. And that gives us a bit of extra food, which should definitely help there. We, we are on the increase at the moment, so it does look like things... Maybe that's just because we've dropped down population, I don't know. It does look like things are starting to happen. That could be the animal slaughtering as well. You've got plenty in you. So I think we definitely do need more hay for the animals which is going to be from here so we're just waiting on that in the meantime though it'd be good if we could prior to prioritize a bit of our fortifications and try and get some of this up now it would be wise also to maybe get some food over here as well we could definitely set up a second area i think at least for meat or a campfire makes sense well maybe we, we might f if we, we've got two granaries here haven't we they're not particularly full so we could always take one down and move it over that's definitely an idea so we've got two granaries so when this one's full they take it second side of the camp would make sense we could also do some meat half all of this and move that over i don't know we'll see we'll see how this pans oh and we've got a third monolith or megalith or mena that's looking quite cool. I'm liking the entrance now. It's coming along quite nicely. We're up to seven knowledge points, so things are progressing. We're just kind of hoping that... What are, where are we getting wood from? Are we getting wood from over here? I cannot remember. I'm not seeing any logs. Your sticks. Your trees. Okay. I'm going to move this again. And we're going to place this in the centre here. We're also going to want a wood storage in this area. I think we should get that set up and we could probably squeeze this i think where would be a nice little place for it. i don't want to take up too much space here but it looks like that's gonna happen what i oh, know i thought i thought it put it in there it didn't but let's get another one set up definitely and we'll get you maybe just there will be fine and this is like the whole production for our copper here so that should be fine um, we've got a tree marked. We can hunt you. Oh no, we don't, we don't want to kill our own goat. It looks like our food, we are going very well into the positive. So this is looking a lot better. 
We may have just turned, got lucky there and turned a cornerstone by, I, I actively went after animals to, I guess you call them tame or to domesticate. And that was a big help. We could already see a lot of hay being used on our houses. I think that's where it's all going. And we're getting a good amount of grain, flour. We haven't really got... That trader definitely helped us there. So we're going to have to start buying food. Definitely going to have to start buying food. That that trader's made us really good. We've got four new people join our settlement. Everyone's a bit overworked at the moment. But it looks like that's because they're doing repairs. And they've all been told to build this fence. Okay, not a problem. Have you built this yet? This is just going to be for logs. Because you just require logs. Is that right? Yeah, so three logs is what that requires. So yeah, we just need logs on that. And what are you waiting for? You're just waiting for logs as well. So we just need logs for everything. It's looking like, why are you stealing twig sticks out of there? Is that what we're doing now, is it? Workload is too high. Okay. Um, What can we do about this? I think this is just the harvest. Once the harvest clears, we will deal with that a bit better, I'm hoping. But it's because we've got all these houses need repairing as well. As long as we don't get attacked now, we should be okay. We've got enough food to ride this out, I think. It shouldn't be too bad. I think we let them get on with it. Because this workload should be coming down, I'm hoping. But we are getting a work getting rid of a lot of this from died of starvation. That's not a problem. Well it is, but I don't see why they are. We've got plenty going on in here. They should be able to get that. Are we doing for clothes? We've got 72, so we've got plenty of skin outfits, plenty of wool, leathers on the increase. The so things are definitely looking slightly better, although the workload... Now, that's going down. Okay, there we are. The workload was sorted. So we didn't really get to harvest all the field, but we have managed to repair quite a lot of buildings, so that's definitely going to help. Two new animals. Milestone unlocked. Domestication knowledge two. Okay, animal limits. Yep, we know about these. Cool, so we've now got enough knowledge points to go into... I think we're going to go into donkeys. That makes sense. Trader has arrived. Right, can we trade anything with you? We we need to keep stuff coming in. So we, can get, we don't need copper ore. I'm going to keep buying food. I think this makes sense at the moment. We're kind of at that stage. Worried about flint. Leather outfits, not too worried. Don't... Tannin? No, I'm not. So we can sell a couple of our axes. Or we can just sell the one. What else can we get for one? We might as well buy that bit of flint then. Or, yeah. I actually need some straw. So let's get the straw. Sell ourselves just the one flint spear. And a flint pick. And maybe a bone. There we go. That should do us. Cool. That will help the houses. I hopefully relieve a bit of pressure on people. Food is coming up nicely. Our harvest is going to help. So that should keep everyone quite busy for a while. Hopefully they will go chop trees down in the winter. So what I was looking for was a donkey or something to the to the or the likes of. Struggling tripping over my words there. Let's see if we can tame a couple straight away. What are you? No, you're a muffalo. Don't know if we can tame them yet, but at least we'll find out. Where is it? No, I'm not seeing anyone close. Any of them close by? What about at that lake over the back of here? They could quite possibly be back here. Let's just sneak across. Not seeing. They're all. I guess they're going to be what the horses were. What are you guys? They're boars. Well, I am not seeing that. I'm not seeing any. No, seeing any of the. It's your adult male. Aha. So this is a bit of a track, but if we can get what you, your male, your male, female, yep. We can get a male and a female. Actually, I'm your female as well. I'm going to send them after these. If we can tame these four donkeys, that's going to really help us. Now I'm going to find a way back to where we live. Just over here, I hope. Yes, perfect. That is a good view looking at the settlement there. It's coming along nicely. We are growing. Struggling for wood, but we must be using it to fix houses. 
So maybe we do need another sort of log camp, quite possibly. Flint mine exhausted. Okay. Um, no, that wasn't the button I meant to click. I was a bear over that. That must be the flint mine that was over. Right place, yeah. That must be the flint mine that was over here. So we need to get another flint mine in. So let's do this now. Um, flint mine. It's gonna take a little while though. Looking at it, I'm sure we saw one. Are you flint? Yeah, we can get one there. We got any piles of flint? You're a pile of flint as well, are you? Cool. We can gather this one. We're gonna be less dependent on the flint now, so I don't think it's gonna be so bad for us. With the flint, we should be able to get that sorted pretty quickly. Oh yeah, we were setting up a place for us to gather some trees. So, and I'm thinking this is a good little area here, so we'll leave someone in that. We're picking up the knowledge points fast and quick now, so we've had another goat be born. Looks like we are struggling with hay still. But I'm hoping that... Oh, there we go, we're chopping the tree down, awesome. We can get one of these houses... Or at least charcoal built. Wood storage. Okay, yeah, that's working perfectly. That's what we wanted. Also means that when they're chopping the trees down here, they're not having to carry it as far, which is good. Should help us. So, yes, we're just repairing houses at the moment. These walls are taking a little while to build. And you're almost full of stone. That Your logs as well. Did I get rid of all of them here? I did. I'm going to put one back because I think we should have just one over here just in case anything's picked up. Yeah, I think that makes sense. And they should store... I'm, I'm, I want more stone being stored because I want to have a lot of stone stockpiled for when the stone wall comes. That's my thought process. Okay, workload is really high at the moment. Let's get rid of that. Are we into autumn? Yeah, everyone is... And the fields, we've not got enough space for animals. That's okay, slaughter them. Oh, we, we've got a donkey. Okay, cool. Awesome. So maybe we do need another one being built. But I was planning to make this slightly different. But okay, needs a must. We need to get one in. Storage, granary, store. No, production. Weaver. Uh, no, no, I know, I know, I know, I can see it. Workshop. No, it must be residence then. There we go. It's been a few... Well, it's been about a week since I played this, so... Not so familiar. Can we get you closer? We can't. Okay. Hoping to get you a bit closer. So we'll put you like this. Just put it slightly different. We're going to make this stable as a priority to try and get everyone over here. Um, but we are lacking on hay. So any time we see the... Trader with hay, we need to buy it. That is kind of a drawback at the moment. Because it's already got everything apart from hay. And... What was that noise there? Oh, it's a tree being cut down, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I thought that was one of, one of my houses falling down. I was like, no way. Okay, so now we've actually increased our logs. So it should be a lot quicker. I know there's not enough space. Should be a lot quicker now for us to fortify. Which is, this is kind of what's chewing all our logs. We're probably going to end up ripping all this down. Well, we know it. But at least we can start. Get it finished. We've got a hut here. Do we need anyone? No, we've still got space for 15 more people. You're a priority, but you haven't got any hay. These are growing, so we will get that soon. I don't want to tell people to collect the wild stuff, do I? Maybe. Maybe not, I don't know. And we've got a storm coming. We've got another knowledge point. So we are picking up knowledge, which is nice. Here's the storm. We haven't made any charcoal yet. Which is a shame. But this is moved, progressing us through the season. And we have got some running repairs that need it. Oh, we've got our watchtowers up over here, which is awesome. So hopefully, if the next raiders do come to this segment, they're going to be in for a bit more of a surprise. Sledges which are no longer usable. I know there's not enough space. Um, probably do with a few sledges. But I think we'll build those in the winter. Just once this harvest is done. 
And what have we got here? What are you guys? Oh, okay, that would be so good to tame one of them. But not yet. That will come. Now that we've got donkeys. I don't know what we're going to do with the donkeys, but we have donkeys. Food is positive again. Raider attack. Okay, cool. Where are these guys coming from? Oh, wow. There's more of them. We're going to shut the gates. Down the alarm. Okay, so they could come into one of our armed wall. Have I locked everyone out? I have, haven't I? Let's open the gates. Get everyone on the walls. We're going to deal with these pretty quickly. Oh, have we lost anyone? No, three humans have been killed. Oh, wow. Okay. So that wasn't that hard. We just obliterated them. I think we may have lost someone. I know we've not got enough space. So we did lose a few people. But I don't think there's a worry about we've got plenty of wool knocking around too which is good that means we're going to be kicking out the woolen outfits so we're going to have lots of different types of clothes and i guess i keep happy as well we've got milk four new people join us which is good food is on the decline at the moment oh first structure metalsmith lovely let's have a no let's not the workshop so what can we build in the metalsmith this is where we make our copper tools Awesome. Where's his wolf attack? Oh, wait, you're dead, mate. Okay, cool. So this is where we make our copper tools and things then. So we're going to need a storage over here as well. That's right. And then we can go into bronze. Okay, so let's get storage put up here. Granary storage hut. Maybe we can just sit you off here. Do we need like one space to be able to get our walls done so we could put you no you won't let me do it we could do something like this that's quite central yeah we're gonna do that there we go okay awesome so we will have people making copper when they can our workshop isn't ready yet i like the looks of it though it's a good model what do we make in here oh we can make a fishing rod we want fishing rods but i'm no I don't imagine we haven't got twine or is that what is that I don't know we can make our bows and our slings in there so what we're going to be able to do soon is we'll be able to decommission this crafter here which will be fine so we've got fishing rods we're going to need let's just have a look oh no that was the wrong button so for the fishing rods we're going to need to figure that out but I think that is all going to be next time so we've had a busy Busy episode here. We've had two raid attacks, which we've dealt with quite well. We've progressed into the Bronze Age, which is looking good too. So I think next time we're still trying to get these walls built up. But they are coming along. We are getting a bit closer to it. It's harvest time, so we are overworked again. But that shouldn't be a problem. And oh, we can also make sleds here as well. Oh, that is awesome. I did not know that. We've got continuous sled production now. So we're not going to have to worry about sleds anymore. So that is brilliant. So on that note, guys, if you enjoyed the episode, hit that thumbs up button, comment below, and subscribe to the channel. All right, guys, take care. Ciao.